Now what we're seeing now is the larger bulls just preparing themselves, they're readying themselves for that moment when everything switches, their hormones start flooding through their bodies and they then go on the hunt for mates. They're sort of on the top of that wave and it's about to break over the reserve. So it's going to be a very exciting time in the next few weeks. The reserve is now full of dozens of elephant families. Among them are the Native Americans, led by their matriarch Mohican. Her impressive tusks almost touch at the tip. Things are about to get interesting for Mohican. Her streaming temple glands are a sign she's in season, and soon she'll be ready to mate. A female in estrus gives off a distinctive scent in her urine. Already there are lusty young bulls on her trail, and they're heading straight into the family. Mohican moves away from her herd and stops the bulls disrupting family life. She can't go too far. She has a two-year-old calf who's relying on her milk. But the amorous bulls don't give her much time to suckle him. All the local bulls are closing in on her. As a matriarch, Mohican has a high rank in the reserve, and these younger males are not the ones she'll want to mate with. She's making her intentions clear, and waiting until the big bulls are here. His head and neck are massive. He's built like a prize fighter, with the aggression to match. There are bloody wounds on his face and trunk. It looks like he's already been fighting. There's only one thing on his mind, finding females. And knowing Rommel, he won't let anything get in his way. Saba can see from his temple glands and streaming urine that Rommel has entered the unique breeding condition of must. It's almost like this super surge of hormones where they're just flooded with testosterone. And it brings them into this heightened state of sexuality and aggression where they find females, mate them, guard them, and if they're forced to fight, then they're ready to escalate. Charged with testosterone, Rommel is at his most dangerous, and he's letting every other bull know he's arrived. Bulls have a very specific rumble that they make when they're in must. What we can hear is just the tip of the iceberg, and there is this huge infrasonic boom that goes rolling out across the plains. And it's making every elephant in the area know that there is a must bull around, and they have to be careful. Rommel is on a mission to find females in season. Like Mohican of the Native Americans family, but the reserve covers over a hundred square miles, so this could be a challenge. If you try to get yourself inside an elephant's head, you have to realize that their primary senses are touch, smell, and sound. And so the way that a must bull homes in on an estrus female is precisely using those senses. And when you watch them, you'll see them constantly scenting the wind and listening and then just literally homing straight in to their one target. Rommel has picked up a scent, but if there's a female in season around, every other bull will also be heading that way. Rommel needs to get there first. It's the end of the day, and Rommel is closing in on his target. 
He's headed straight for a herd of females. It's Mohican, the matriarch in season. Rommel has tracked her scent halfway across the reserve. But another bull has got here first, a big male called Kofi. Rommel makes his move. As the two giants size each other up, the tension rises. And it's Kofi who backs down. Rommel greets the family. To win them over, he needs to make a gentle approach. The whole herd seem fascinated by this enormous stranger. But Kofi isn't leaving. The allure of a female in season is just too strong. So far, it's Rommel who's proving to be a hit with the ladies. When he moves off, Mohican and the rest of the family follow him. But if Rommel isn't vigilant, Kofi could chance a mating with Mohican. For the next few days, Rommel will shadow Mohican day and night, and he must be prepared to fight off Kofi.